What is intermittent fasting? Intermittent fasting, or IF, means following a schedule where you alternate between periods of time of voluntary fasting or significantly reduced caloric intake and non-fasting or regular caloric intake. There's many different forms of it and these can include alternate day fasting, where you fast one day and then eat normally the next, periodic fasting, where two days of the week you consume between 500 to 600 calories and the other five days you eat your normal caloric intake, and time-restricted eating or TRE. The last one is definitely the most common form that I see in my clinical practice. And this involves eating calories during a four to 12 hour window during the day. And the rest of the day, you consume either water or zero calorie beverages. When you eat in the day it does seem to matter with more benefits seen with an early eating time window in the day. And the length of fast can also matter with more benefits seen with a 16 hour fast compared to a 12 hour fast. So what are the benefits? Well, intermittent fasting or TRE can help you consume fewer calories in the day without the hassle of having to count every single calorie that you eat. It's also free, simple and easy, and doesn't require a lot of meal prepping or time. It can assist with weight loss and it can reduce your risk of diabetes, heart disease, it can improve your blood pressure and it can reduce inflammation. And importantly, TRE has not been shown to adversely affect maintenance of muscle mass, which is really important in weight loss. But it's not for everybody. First of all, TRE and IF are not appropriate for patients with eating disorders or women who are pregnant or breastfeeding. Also, a number of studies actually show that it doesn't lead to more weight loss than just conventional calorie counting. Also, when some people fast, they can overindulge in their eating window and consume more calories than they normally would. And of course, this isn't going to lead to weight loss. So IF and TRE are really not for everybody, but if you feel like it's a good fit for you, have a chat with your doctor to see if this way of eating is appropriate and safe for you.